Salutations, this is Grim Deville. Welcome to our Let's Try of Crown Trick. Crown Trick is in closed beta right now for this week only, and they were kind enough to send me along a key. Uh, this music might be a little bit loud, so let's uh, lower that just a teensy tad. Um, but it's, uh, so this is a turn-based roguelike game, and I love me a turn-based roguelike game. I guess all roguelikes are turn-based, uh, if they're a real roguelike. Uh, this one specifically advertises synchronous turns, so I think if you attack an enemy, they attack you at the same time. I'm not sure how that's, it's, and it kind of sells this as a new idea, although I'm not sure quite how that's different from a traditional roguelike, but we're going to find out. I'm going to hit start game. I haven't taken the tutorial or anything. We're just going to jump right into it. I love roguelikes. So blink is right click. Is that okay? It's uh, loading, I think. Uh, I love roguelikes. Uh, they're probably my favorite kind of game. I'm not great at them, uh, only because I I'm impatient. I'm an impatient man. Um, okay, here we go. Tower of Sinners. So a couple of weapons over here. And yeah, I am. I guess it is turn based. I'm using W A S and D and the mouse. It gave me an option to do. Keyboard only, mouse only, or combination. I figured I'd fig start with combination and see how it goes. Um, it's a very big screen. The art style, it looks beautiful. It's probably not specifically my kind of thing. I'm a little more um, ASCII. And this looks a little, I don't know, most too user-friendly for me. It looks nice, objectively. But subjectively, um, let's see, Spear of Endless Chaos. We have 27 attack. When your attacks hit an enemy, your hit points will also be reduced. But when the target is defeated, you will be able to regain some hit points. Ah, okay, interesting. And increases crit chance by 5%. Cursed weapon. Um, I don't know if, if I pick it up if I have to use it. We'll interact with that later. And this is a demonic battle axe. Slightly higher attack. Uh, and 3%, whatever this is, magic, I don't know what that is. Extremely high attack. 50% chance of attack to apply scorched to self. I imagine that scorched is bad. Uh, when you blink, you have 5% chance to consume no blink uses. Oh, that's good, I assume. Um, you know, I don't, I don't know what Scorched is like, but I think I'm going to go for the Spear of Endless Chaos. Yeah. I like it. Oh, did we already have a different weapon? Oh, no, that's what we're holding. Okay, cool. We also seem to have, oh, use blink, and we have three uses of that. Uh, and there is a... I don't know if we get more of these, if they, like, regenerate over time or what. Uh, shift, turn, turn directions. Oh, okay. And then we have an elixir to regain hit points and magic points both. We have 300 hit points and 200 magic points. That seems like a lot. We have 67 normal attack damage, skill power, poison resist, I assume, and element resist. Okay, okay. And we got some other things, some doodads. What is all this? Can we... Oh, we can get all these things. I can click on it, too. I can either walk right up to it or click on it. Uh, all right. Got some gold books. Yeah, you can only seem to have one weapon at a time. I don't know what goes into this slot, either. All right, let's interact with this thing. A familiar crystal. Oh, we get a familiar! And we can carry up to two... Um, so Ab Abaddon has Missile Guard, summons a ranged servant, has a chance to summon an elite, an elite ranged servant. Uh, okay. And Fire Shield. So wait, our familiar can summon its own servant? Neat. And Fire Shield, a shield of flames and for your, for self and all minions. Are that, or is this a, is this a minion that has minions? I'm, I'm a little confused. Uh, an absorption shield of 15% of max hit points. While the shield is active, all attacks, all attacking enemies will also be scorched. Uh, and you can see there's a little graphical, like it doesn't quite fit in that box. This is still beta. Uh, I'm sure they're going to be fixing all that stuff uh, before full release. Knockback, all enemies on tiles. Uh, so this is uh, Mandragora. Mandragora. Um, knockback on all en enemies on tiles in front of your character. Okay, for stun... If an enemy is knocked into an object, an additional wind damage will be dealt with increased duration of the stun. And a 3x3 three three poisonous vine, which stuns and gives stacks of poison. And then we have the swash cuckler. Uh, back step strike, shift backward two tiles and shoot boomerang forward, dealing 50 wind damage. And swallow flip, instantly launch five attacks on targets 
with five vertical tiles, dealing 17 physical damage. Um, probably either Abaddon or Mandragora. Uh, and with our weapon, let's see. Uh, I mean, this one seems a little more protective, right? And gives you some ranged ability. Um, but I kind of like the poison stuff and the knockback. And we do have a spear. I don't know if there's, like, range on it, if it's a reach weapon or not. Um, uh, I, I feel like I want to see Abaddon more. So we're going to go for Abaddon. Oh, wait, can I? No, I can't select both. Okay, done. All right. So let's go. Where's our... Oh, here we go. So now we can do Missile Guard for 60 MP. And we can also do Fire Shield. And that helps for all means. So our Familiar just gives us these abilities. Okay. Okay. Interesting. Aha! A Clearer of Ways. Do we have Reach? I think we do have Reach. Like if I attack now... Yeah. Uh, you hit us for t 20. Okay. Oh, you hit us both. Okay. Combo prepare? Is this thing not dead? Stunned. Can't perform action. Break damage. I'm just going to hit it again, I guess. All right. It's dead. And we do seem to regen. Can I hit period to... Or is there a... X, I guess. Skip turn. If I do that enough. No, I don't know what caused us to regen. Maybe maybe we got something that gave us regen. A lava barrel. Lava that covers a 3x3 three three area. When wrecked. Alright. Hello. Crown. Although familiar skills in Blink have proven to be very helpful, you might hesitate to use them sometimes when you're low on magic point or, us or usages. It is perhaps human nature to worry without reason, but fear not in my presence. For I will fully replenish your magic points and blink usages every time you enter battle in a new area. Oh. Focus on defeating the enemies in front of you instead. Okay. Good to know. Um, when entering battle for the first time. I see. So it encourages you to use all your blink and all your magic points every room. Okay, so you... I don't know if that means you're aware of us. Yeah, chasing. Uh, let's summon a missile guard. Um, let's put you right next to us. And do we need to fire shield? Sure. What else are we using our magic points for? All attacking enemies will be scorched. Cool. Let's kill this hog first. Um, let's see. Do I back up? What if I back up? Oil explosion. If I attack forward, will it hit our minion? Let's find out. Looks like it did not hurt our minion. So we kind of used our minion as a little shield there. Which, you know, we... Uh, yeah. Does our servant actually firing? And we, we got more health when we killed that. Oh, okay. Let's wait. Attack. Back up. Oh, so our servant is casting oil explosion. I dig it. Cool. Uh, beautiful. Is there anything else in this room? We're getting gold. Where is the gold? Oh, there, 31 gold. Uh, I, I see this message. Can I... Oh, whoops. I hit right click. Oh, that's blink. Right. Uh, it's good to see how blink works. Can we get anything here? Okay, that's it. So entering a new room... Oh, we didn't use... We didn't need blink, but we should see our magic points restore when we enter a new battle is that a creature
Oh, sweet. I guess it was, but it was easy to kill. Mana storage. After defeating enemies with normal attacks, restore 10 magic points. Just so, know you will, uh, just so that you know, I will be constantly monitoring your status during our journey and record everything you see within different dream realms. If you forget, if you forget anything, just come to me. Only by constant learning will we reach our goal. Uh, okay. So we have a relic. I see. Cool. Encyclopedia, common enemies. Cool. A pig that was turned to a warrior or a warrior that was turned into a pig. I dig it. I dig it. Uh, oh, these are some familiars. Yeah, weapons. We definitely haven't seen all of these, so this is interesting. And characters. We only have L. Um, and we have an empty slot for a familiar. No items, no blueprints. No, what blueprints do. And what was that we just got? Doesn't say. That green crystal thing. Oh, maybe it gave us this. Ten of whatever this is. Okay. We're still at 90 MP. When we enter... Our familiar is still with us, which is cool. Or our, our uh, summon. These contraptions are called waypoints, and they're the most common in the Nightmare Realm. They will be ready for use once activated. Using waypoints can save us a lot of time. Uh, okay. Aha! Nice little map. Uh, exploration, merchant, treasure, spring of regen. Spring of regen and a boss. Boss is down here. This is an event up here. I assume we, we should go to the event first. And there's a the waypoint here. Um. All right. How do we get across? Choose a waypoint and teleport. Uh, I guess I have to blink across. Wait, I can I? I can't. Okay. Is there? Oh. Oh, I see. You have to click it on the map. Gotcha. And we can go back there anytime we want. All right, let's go head towards this event here. Dream Realm Monument. Uh, touch the monument to gain access to distant dreams. Okay. The Nameless Statue. You notice the gentle glimmer of white marble in the darkness a few steps away. Upon further inspection, you find an angelic statue of a robed female looking down on you, its expressions serene yet resolute. Pray with sincerity, and a blessing shall be bestowed upon you. However, know that power is never granted for free. So we can pray. So we can raise our hit points at the expense of magic. Get some magic at the expense of hit points. Uh, all damage dealt 10%, but lose plus 10%, but lose some hit points and magic points. I don't think I want any of that stuff. I don't know enough about the game mechanics to know if any of those are a good deal. I guess we can come back later and do it. Yeah, we can come back later and do it. Okay. Do we go to the boss or do we keep going north? Tempted to go to the boss. Although, maybe we should wait till we're done with the entirety of floor one. Yeah, we should probably do that. Let's get some experience. Assuming, assuming there is experience. Which I'm actually not sure about. I don't see anything like that here. But we could raise, I don't know, find more loot to raise our attack or whatever. I mean, yeah, I don't see any levels. All right, yeah, we got our magic points back. What is this? What are these red squares? One. Rain of arrows. I see. So it was a countdown. Oil explosion. Beautiful. Two turns, but I can hit him this turn. And he's dead. Oh, there's another one over there. I didn't even see. I can walk through here, no problem. Our minion, however, is dead. That's okay. We can get another one. Because we get our magic points back every time. Might as well get a fire shield, too. Release. Nice. Oh, I didn't even have to do anything. 
Uh, a new weapon. A demonic battle axe. This looks... Well, it's a better demonic battle axe than the one we were offered at the beginning because it has a plus 7 uh, to the attack and a 7% whatever this is. I don't know. I still don't know what that is, that symbol. Um, maybe it increases our magic points by 7% or our spell power if we ever get spells. I guess these are spells. Fire shield and missile guard. Possibly. But I'm pretty happy with their Spear of Endless Chaos. Oh, right. I forgot that when our attacks hit an enemy, our hit points will be reduced. That's probably why we got that minus 10% when we killed that broom. And then we get when the, why we're getting... Right. I totally forgot about that. I was like, oh, that's an interesting mechanic. We're getting life after each battle. No, that's our weapon. And I immediately forgot about it. And I'm still happy with that. And uh, this magic broom is just hanging out there. Doesn't seem hostile. Okay. Oh, nice. Uh, we can destroy some of the furniture. All right. Uh, we do have a turn counter. I wonder how much that's actually going to affect. All right. Uh, I guess we could have used the waypoint to jump down here faster. Oh, what is this? All right. Is this... This isn't the boss room yet. No. And I don't have... We don't have ranged attacks, so we can't use these... Attack these lava barrels here, but... Um, I might as well fire shield. Oh, they're walking through the lava. It's interesting. You fool. Level six. Oh, you have a Mandragora. Which has the ability to poison. And I can't attack you over there. No. Ooh. Chasing. Do I wait a turn? I'm going to go approach. E. All right, we're going to get hit here. Nothing we can do about it. We might as well attack. All right, we got pushed back. Barely barely hit us. Oh, and that's not a level. That's how much, uh, what your shield is. And we just broke your shield a bit. Also, do I shield? Oh, I guess it could have blinked. Could blink now. I'm gonna get right in front of you. And attack. And attack more. Are we I think attack more, because it is stunned. So damage you get 20% extra damage taken on you. Our undead undead ranger. Yeah, I guess he is our undead. Our Mizzaguard is an Undead Rager. Uh, you are also stunned. What are you going to do? Um, what can you do, Flame a Bird? Chasing. Oh, yeah. I, oh, because you're in this uh, bramble, I see. Let's go to the right. Yeah, this thing is chasing us. But I can go up now. Can I attack down here? Oh, I can. Oh, you hit us. Okay, uh, but flame -a bird is deeply confused after being on fire. Did I hit, strike you on fire? I think I can kill you this turn. All right, just going to step to the right. Step to the right. So we somehow got another blink. I don't know how we got that. Uh, but I think I'm going to use this turn. What is, what's up with us? Why are we on fire here? Uh, I think we're going to cast another missile guard. Wait, what? Is that our missile guard? Or is that an enemy? All right, he was ours. That is our friend. Let's blink again. Um, let's get right here. And attack. And attack again. Nice. What are you doing? Mutation. The healing herb has turned poisonous, is now immune to poison debuffs. That's okay. We're not poisoning. This stuff is tough. I think we need a better weapon. I mean, we're doing okay, I think. We are losing some hit points every turn. Which isn't great. 
This thing has a lot of, it's stunned, it's on, it's breaking, embers at its, oh, it leaves embers at its feet, and it's poisoned. All right, it's attacking our minion there. We can't uh, use our fire shield because it's on cooldown, I think. Oh, we know, we don't have the magic points. All right, it's dead. Um... It should move. It should really move. Rain of arrows. Okay. Let's come down. That's okay. We can hit it from right here without being in danger. Oh, that's our guy that's going to attack it. Oh, sweet. I'll get that after the battle's over, I think. No problem. It always, It tells us where they're going to attack each time. Crude Bomb. Explodes three turns after release, dealing lava damage to all eight adjacent tiles. It's an item. We don't have an item, so we might as well use our item slot. Uh, put that in our item slot. Cryolite Blades. Dual Blade. So it's much less attack. Every nine hits, the next attack will make the target frozen. Whenever you defeat an enemy, increase your... Uh, personal defense? Poison defense, maybe. By ten for five turns. I think we need more power, though, because it took us a, quite a few hits to destroy that guy. Yeah, I think we're going to keep the Chaos Spear here. We'll see what's in this chest, though. What do we got? Whirlwind Ruin. R rune. Uh, deals minor wind damage to one tile within a four-square radius. Applying Silenced. Uh, I think I might like our item better. Explodes three turns after release, stealing lava to all. Um. Although, silenced might be really powerful. Yeah, you know what? And this could be dangerous because we'll have to walk on the lava too. I think I like this one. I think I like the ability to silence if we encounter someone with powerful spells. So, oh, and this is a relic. Summon a random relic. Oh. Uh, is this rarity? Like, this is not rare. When using a skill, there's a... The color, Philosopher's Stone. When using a skill, there's a 25% chance that magic points will be... So it'll be free. Won't cost anything. When continuously using the same skill, reduce the base magic po magic points cost by 20%. And the more enemies in combat there are in a room, the more your poison defense will be raised. Or personal defense. I'm not sure what the P means. Um, I think the Philosopher's Stone. And there's another waypoint. Yes, I, I see. Use item E. Okay. Now, I don't think we get our health points back between rooms. Uh, I don't want to fight the boss yet. Uh, exploration to the south. Whatever that means. Oh. Oh, another familiar. Well, that's great. Reaper of Pumpkins. Yeah, so we've seen the Mandragora and the Swatchcockler. Reaper of Pumpkins incur a violent earthquake to all your enemies, dealing earth damage to all enemy tiles and their surrounding tiles. That sounds pretty powerful. Uses a lot of magic points. And Triumphant Charge. Charge as a target, dealing 50 physical damage. And stun. Also powerful. Yeah, I like Reaper of Pumpkins. I have enhanced your capability so that you may use the skills of two familiars at once. This way, we might have a better shot at defeating Vlad. Okay. Cool, I like it. And now there's nowhere left to go except fight that boss. Let's do it. Hmm. Okay. All right. I mean, it's, it looks like there's a boss in this room, but I guess we have to go in here. Taking advantage. Wait, what? Was there no boss? There was no boss. Oh, no, this is the boss. Okay, there's a... I think we preemptively get our missile guard. And our shield. We have enough magic points for Terra Whirlwind or Triumphant Charge, not both. That's pretty big. Uh, doesn't doesn't 
It says all enemy tiles. So it shouldn't affect me or my minion. 50? What is that? That 50. That shield. El Diablo. And something's back there. I could charge. I could also earthquake. Tempted to earthquake. Let me walk forward one more. All right, this earthquake. Oh, you're flying. Well, it'll affect the other two, although I, I could charge, which would stun you. I'm going to wait a turn. One more. Uh, okay. I think charge. Okay. Cool. You're stunned. We don't have any magic points. We can blink. Oh, we can also, of course, use our crude bomb. Wait. Oh, we have more than one item. Oh, look at that. It's not like the weapons where you have to pick one. I think I might want to silence this person. One tile within a four tile radius. Leah, yeah, let's silence you. All right. Cool. Now we attack. Or... I so said we have three of those. I can use the crude bomb. Which does... Explodes three turns after release. Eight adjacent tiles. Oh, I see. Every... Yeah, throw it right there. Oh, I can't. Throw it right there. While this guy in front of us is stunned, although I don't think you're stunned anymore. All right, let's attack. Attack again. Oh, sweet. Oh, wow. That exploded all the things around us, including our minion and us. That was... I kind of didn't realize that it would explode all the things around it. I should have. That is inexperience. Um, and Duai is not very hurt. And we don't have enough magic for familiar. But we have an elixir. I think we use it at this point. I'm also on... What is this? Greasy. I'm greasy. I think I back up. Move to the right. And drink the elixir. Uh, I hit F. Oh, I have to hold F. Okay. Nice. Got most of my life back. I seem to be on fire? Or maybe it's just behind me. It's just the graphics. Um, so now I can get another missile guard. And another fire shield. Soul Reap you cast on me. Um, what does that do? Shield of, Oh, we have Shield of Flames. I don't see any st other status effects on us. I think I'm just going to attack you. Um, and now I'm going to move to the right. End up. All right, you are poisoned, which is good. Yeah. I could uh, triumph and charge, which would stun you. You know what? I may do that. Nice. You're stunned. You're poisoned. Uh, I think we just got some life from you. Or was that magic? We can fire shield again if we need to. Uh, are you still stunned? No. I think we fire shield. I'm going to move up to avoid this lava burst. Move to the left. Left again. I wanted to avoid those brambles. I could charge again. In fact, I think I will. Let's stun you. Oh, I wanted... I can't get a free attack in now because my, uh, my little Mandragora there. All right, we'll just attack. We have no magic. All right, we got hurt a little bit with that Soul Reap. But you're poisoned. You're scorched. I think we're doing okay here. All right, you are... That, that hurt. Do it again. Um, yeah, do it, or do I want to, 
apply silence to you. I mean, your attacks hurt. I think I'll silence you. It hurts you too. Ooh, wow, what just happened to you? You're stun that stunned you somehow? Maybe the Mandragora did that. You are silenced. Are you broke? Are you stunned for six turns? Wow, I think you are. Oh, our, our guy brambled us. I wasn't paying attention. Mandragora, that was dumb. Stunned for one more turn. All right, we attack. Uh, do we attack or do we fire shield? And we attack. All right, move to left. Now we fire shield. And now we attack. Oh, nice. Very good. All right, so I think we're we're about halfway. She's about halfway down. We are slightly less than halfway down. We have a bunch of blink. Not that we really need it right now. Um, I think I'll use this item one more time on you. That seems pretty powerful. You're silenced again. You're attacking our companion, who has a lot more life than we do right now. Um, although you just lost your shield. Oh, wait, brambles. I didn't notice them. It's a little hard to see. Oh. All right, now we blink, because else we're going to get hit. Let's blink over here, I guess. All right, now we might be in a little bit of trouble. Uh, we might be able to do another missile guard. Oh, dear. In a moment. Oh, wait, I didn't see the bramble there. Oh, I'm so bad at this. That was bad. That was bad. Um, I think we need to use this again. Let's blink. Let's kind of reset this fight. Let's get over here. Use our elixir. Our last one. Earthquake is not going to... I mean, it says all... It says it will hurt all enemies. But... Because this one is floating, I feel like it won't. I guess we could try it out. First, we make a missile guard, though. Cool. An undead ranger. Uh, if we fire shield, we won't be able to tear a whirlwind, and I want to try this out. Let's try it. All right, it, I think it did hurt Dewey. You're stunned for five turns. I don't want to waste those five turns getting to you. I'm going to blink right here. Attack. Um, I have two turns, so I'm going to use one to attack here. And then I'm going to back up. Dwight's pretty hurt. Let's walk up again. Stun for one more turn. Um, and I think we fire shield now. And now we blink behind her. And attack. Sweet. Uh, we are again in some kind of fire zone, so I'm going to move to the left. Oh, wait! I messed that up. I thought it was one... Uh, it was, it's a little hard, because it's not really it's it looks bird's eye but it's kind of isometric and i can't really always tell where i'm standing um but again that's partially just inexperience we lost our our missile guard but we can cast a new one let's fire okay uh we have magic we can charge in fact i think it's a good idea right now let's charge stun you you're right, you're being flanked by us. Not that that's a status. We should be able to kill you in a couple of turns. Our minion, I think, does more damage than we do. Our sword does not do a lot of damage. Um, I'm going to attack you here, and then we have one turn to get out of the way. Which I will do. All right, now I'm going to blink. And I think fire... Uh, yeah, fire shield. Or... Another Missile Guard. The Missile Guard does more damage than we do. We're not going to die. We have two Blinks. Let's use one here. Because you're almost dead. 
There we go. Unlocked a relic, a legendary relic. Many other adventurers and warriors before you have left their marks in this world. Their legendary weapons are scattered across the Nightmare Realm. If you don't like your current weapon, there are plenty of others to choose from. To face vicious enemies, you have to choose your weapons carefully. Various rare relics are hidden across the Nightmare Realm, left by warriors of the past. And I guess now we're asking... Oh, that's our crown on our head. I didn't realize that. If they are really that precious, shouldn't we try to return them to their owners? It's been decades or even centuries since their visits. I don't think it's necessary anymore. Use them in your fight against the power of Nightmare. That's their original purpose of existence after all. So we... Did we just get a relic? No, not a new one. And I think this did come... I think this did happen once in a while. I think there, there were some points where we didn't expend magic. Although I didn't... There's not like a combat log that makes it clear when that's happening. Um, that might be a nice feature. Maybe that's something we can, like, turn on. Attack assist. Show item. Yeah, I don't know. I don't see anything like that. But that would be cool. That would be a cool feature, devs. Let's open this up. This must be the legendary relic, or... A bunch of treasure. Which I assume there will be shops at some point. Here we go. Here's the advanced relic. Let's pick that up last. Oh, a rifle! Yeah! Well, if, A, it's, um, I think the color means it's greater rarity, has much greater range. Um, we don't have a crit chance or a chance to regain hit points, but it doesn't cause us to lose hit points either. And it's, it does have a 10% chance to stun. The damage is much higher. It has 10% whatever this is. And a 50% chance to automatically, automatically reload, but that, that means that there is a reload functionality. When you hit two or more, en more enemies at the same time. Still, seems like a better weapon. I'm excited about that. Stat scroll. So this is basically like leveling up. Skill power, this means. Um, I like our skills. I think I'm going to take this, actually. Anyway, it gives us more of all the same stats. But I think rather than the crit damage, I want I want better, more skill power. Let's do that. Oh. And what is this? 20... I don't know what these are or what this is. And this advanced relic. Okay. Either skills will also be able to crit. That's interesting. When using a skill, there's a 25% chance to recast the ability on the same target. Yeah, I don't know about that one. And an elemental cube, when you deal a critical hit to an enemy, they will also receive one random element, elemental status condition. Well, we're doing less critical hits now. So I think we're going to do Horn of Critical Strike. We're going to go more of a skill-based build here. Cool. And the stairs are now unlocked. Can I... Oh, cool. Do I reload? Yeah. So you fire twice and then another shot reloads. Um, so you have to be a little more deliberate about it, but that's what roguelikes are all about. Okay. Um, that's probably the end of this Let's Try. But let's see what happens at the end of the stairs. Okay, so we're at a new level, it seems. Yeah, so I'm going to put a cut in here. Can I save it? No, there's no save functionality. This is still just the closed beta. Um, I might record one more episode. I was planning on only doing one of these, but I guess we'll do another one. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this. I really did. Um, this is definitely a, a fun game. Um, and it seems like it's staying true to the core concept of what a roguelike should be. Um, and I dig it. So again, this is Crown Trick. Uh, it comes out of closed beta in just a few days. Um, just like a couple of days. And I'm not sure when the release date is, but I think it's very soon. It might even be right at the very end of the closed beta. Um, I'm not certain. Uh, look it up. <laughs> Crown Trick. Uh, I'll try to post a link in my description. Um, yeah, I enjoyed playing with you today, and I'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.